in three, two, one, charge. And with that, the playoffs on Carson have begun. Ross spots in blue beginning as a spy bot, but their shot misses. Code Red Robotics and their partner Roboctics make it in the high goal. In blue, only one robot makes it in that high goal. Red will have the advantage coming, blue will have the advantage coming out of Autonomous. Already we have high gold shots from Code Red Robotics, Crescent Robotics, and Graybots. And this just in, we have got Big Bad Bob with some damage. They were playing defense, but their shield is now on the ground. It is attached to their robot. And it's causing issues as Big Bad Bob plays defense. With a minute and a half to go, Rustbot's playing defense against Crescent Robotics, trying to prevent them from scoring. They're pushing Crescent around, making it very difficult for them to do anything. Red with only a 10 point lead, 80 to 70. Into the high goal it goes, thanks to Graybot. With over a minute to go, Big Bad Bob still playing defense despite their broken robot. They're pulling that part around only by pneumatic tubing, but it is just strong enough for it to stay attached. Red beginning to pull ahead with scores from Crescent Robotics and Graybots in the high goal. At this point, both outer works still stand. In our playoffs, breaching the outer works becomes something worth points. 30 seconds to go. Robots racing back to their opponent's courtyards. Graybots damaging the rock wall with 20 seconds to go. The Blue Alliance breaches the Outer Works, but right now it's all red. Crescent Robotics attempting to scale, but they are not hooked on. Rossbots going up and up. Two Red Robots scaling. They make it just in time. That's Graybots and Crescent Robotics for the scales. You could not ask for a more exciting match to start our Carson playoffs. It was an action-packed match, but here are the scores. It's the Red Alliance, 212 to 154. Our Red number one alliance with their first victory in the semifinals.